Hello queens and kings, my name is Tandega Shabangu. Welcome to my channel. If it's your first time here, welcome, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back. Welcome to the vlog. I'm currently in Pomalanga, Efeni. So, I challenged my aunt. So this is the grass ring that we use for um, your neck pieces. In Sometimes in the Ndebele culture they make bangles, they make yuholwane. So I usually buy this. So I challenged my aunt, I said to my aunt, please help me find this grass so that we can attempt making <laughs> one for ourselves, making the grass rings for ourselves. So today's vlog will be all about us going to Ekhatini and looking for the grass and then we come back and sort it out and attempt to make this ring so this is an attempt we don't know how it's gonna go we've never done this before Auntie he she makes um the grass mats so she has no idea when it comes to this so let's see Rara, jump on him full. and Okay. Has no money Found it. Um, remember, we're just experimenting, so so this is the one. We will have to see. Is is Tando? Answers the end. I think so. We're going to experiment with this one. One, two, three, up seven, six, and look for two sweet to make in Chinese. So we'll see as we get higher if it, it, it does the do's. <laughs> it does the does. Now we give a bonk. So it's in piles and piles and piles and piles and piles. Here's another pile. Okay, let me get to work. <laughs> There's a road there. That's where we're going. That's, oh, there's a car. I think there's one car. That one, the black one. That's where we're going. We're going back to grass number two. Oh, here's another car. Here's another car. That's we. Amazing. 
is tala. Let's see. Is tala. Let's see. Nazo. Okay. There we go. Now we need anti kill. And double round to get a good right now. I think you will love anti Yeah, I'm coming on at you. Good look. Hmm. Because go round. This is where we just from we were from to get our grassy grassy. Now we're in the woods searching for mushrooms again. Yeah, we're heading back home now. This is our grassy grassy. <laughs> yeah, yo. So now the first step is to peel the grass strands. So the grass comes in about three strands. As you can see, Uanti here, she's peeling the strands. Hi, queens and kings. So today is day two of the grass bangle. So yesterday I attempted to do the bangle and it was a total flop. It ended up with sharp, I think about three sharp corners so i was frustrated i was annoyed i was frustrated annoyed and frustrated and extra annoyed so i ended up leaving everything the way it was and so today is a new day i'm thinking of using a different strategy um hopefully it will go well and i'll share with you the steps if it goes well <laughs> but uh, the biggest job is Uklub, peeling off the three strands of grass that's the hectic part so today's day two we'll see how it goes so at this point i had already started with my ring as you can see in the back top there i've done my ring so now i wanted to show you how do i start so now i'm busy with the bangle but the starting part is the same so i take four strands and I tie a knot with my cotton you don't need a needle put your needle to the side and then as you can see I've tied my my knot and then I start sort of wrapping the cotton around the strands I start wrapping the cotton around the strands as you can see the cotton that I'm using I'm using upholstery thread that is the thread that i'm using so i'm wrapping it around i keep wrapping it around into the four strands and then halfway i decided to join add more strands but if you're using a bangle you can add just two strands but if you're going to make a huge neck bangle you can add three more strands so I just added, added the three strands, I placed them on top of the previous strands of grass and then I wrap. I wrap and I wrap and I wrap. That's what you do all the way until you have the desired length of wrapped grass that can make a circle suitable for, for your, your bangle. Or for the neck piece so you just keep wrapping and wrapping and wrapping as you can see I start again I add the next the next strand of grass just place it on top and then Continue to wrap with your thread. That's all you do. Just wrap, wrap, wrap. Add your strands of grass and wrap, wrap, wrap. So now, now I'm doing my bangle because the neck piece I'm done with it. So now you're just going to take, you take the 
the beginning of the strands of grass that you had and you place them just make sure it interacts correctly sorry it does not show well just put it inside underneath the other strands of grass as you can see here and then you continue to wrap this is my bangle. Oh, it's, so, it's a bit big. I didn't see at that time. I realized mm -hmm. later on would know this is a very big bangle. But you can do the size of, that you desire. If you want the neck piece, you make the circle that is big enough for the neck, necklace part. This is a bangle, so the circle is small. But if you're going to do the, the neck, the necklace one, make sure that your circle is bigger so you want to measure it the way you desire and you keep wrapping now i'm wrapping make sure at this stage you don't have corners make sure it's nice and round if you have corners at this point redo the the joining of your grass here it is i kept adding the grass kept adding the grass this is the bangle, so you keep wrapping, you keep adding your grass, keep wrapping, and you keep adding your grass. As you can see, so when your bangle has attained its shape, you're going to add your grass at the, at the sides because you want it to be thicker. So you're not going to add your grass at the center. You add it on the side. As you can see, I added one strand of grass on one side and another strand of grass on the other side. That makes it round and thicker. That's what I So now the thread is going to run out. What you're just going to do... I'm just going to add the thread. The tail and the tail of the other one. And what you do is make a knot like this. See? So you just done like that then you're going to make the thread as long as you want it to be then you just cut i don't like to make it as long because it sort of like delays me so you just continue wrapping continue wrapping and wrapping so another thing as you go by can you see the amount of grass that i have at the tail i will okay so this is the amount of grass that i have what you're going to do as you go you're going to keep adding so i have six let me pick six six of the grasses remember the grass we did peel them off i need because the one grass comes in like three strands so i peeled the grass off so the first three strands i'm going to add it here at the top underneath at the top and then the other three strands i'm going to add it here at the bottom underneath here yeah then okay just make sure Wooty, it's tucked in neatly and then you keep spreading the grass like this so that you can be able to maintain the thickness remember this is the thickness that we're going for so for you to get the thickness you have to keep spreading the grass now just make sure your strands are tucked in nicely and then you continue with your rolling so you're just going to keep doing that just keep adding your grass all the way oops what i did so that means i'm just gonna fasten my thread so you're just going to keep adding your, your three grass at the top and at the bottom and keep rolling with your cotton
please my Ndebele people please tell me how I did these are the results please give me your critique and how I can improve next time I really really would love to hear from you and thank you so much for watching queens and kings i love you guys so so much remember to love yourself respect yourself honor yourself and have fun if you love the content that you're seeing please consider subscribing bye this is how everything turned out bye